Hey everyone, welcome back to Clusterfuck Vended Minds channel where I talk about dreams, just dream mainly dreams and in my interpretation of the dream and also I incorporated with other people's definition of their actually their interpretation and also my own and molded it to my own too as well. I put some references and also I credit other people's work and I also have a experience with dreaming and how I interpret it my own way and if you don't want to listen to me <laughs> talk just look be down below the, the description because I know how people are they uh, don't have time to listen or they don't like listening to people they don't like the voices <laughs> So if you want to pause my video, you can. And also please subscribe and let's get started. So the topic for today is dreaming about a beach, sea, or ocean. They're both synonym to each other, just the name by itself and also the meaning. Well, not the beach part, but the sea and ocean are synonym to each other. So dreaming about a beach, sea, Ocean can have multiple meanings depending on the content of the dreams, feelings, colors, your tradition, cultural aspect, and many more that can be considered before jumping into conclusion and how you interpret things. Don't listen to other people, but listen to your dream and its content. Don't base go off base on other people's opinion. Just read it to your own way. The, the dream is of your own and not others beach can signify an unconscious meet the conscious mind that also considered an ocean and sea the interpretation though could change as a matter of fact like i said the feelings colors your colors your tradition and many other things so the first interpretation of dreaming about the beach sea or ocean is that in the near future, you're going to have financial instability, which you need to have your financial situation in order so that your problem can be answered. This is, this is if you dream in a sandy beach, though. The second interpretation is when you are at the beach and reach the land signifies a new change in life or just a new, a new leaf. Third, if the water is calm from the beach, from the ocean, beach, or sea, then it means that you will have a good omen, wanting an easy life. The fourth interpretation is that if you are swimming in the open beach, ocean, sea, then you are enlarging your influence or network. You will also go abroad or travel more in the near future, or you're planning to. Number five of the interpretation is that to dream of being far out in the ocean and hearing the waves forebodes business life and quarrels and stormy periods in the household. Number six, if you dream of yourself on shore and see the ocean waves foaming against one another, you may narrowly escape injury. Number seven of the interpretation to dream, uh, to dream of seeing the ocean so shallow as to allow waiting or a view of the bottom signifies prosperity and pleasure, which means that if you see that if the if the water is clear and you can see below the sand, then you will have a prosperity and great pleasure. Number eight, to dream of a calm ocean, ocean whether sailing on it or not is always a good omen this also considered that you will have a you will have your you will broaden your horizon and also you will go sailing not sailing actually not sailing you will travel more and also network like the other the um the what, what was the other number four yeah it's kind of the same way but yeah it's similar number nine so in Artemi Artemidorus interpretation, which was translated in 1975 
by Robert J. White, thanks to him. Is it right? 1975? I bought the book actually because it was interesting. He translated it. And one of the translation and the interpretation is that it signifies a young man's love for prostitutes. Yep, you hear it right there. That was the, in the um, olden past. And also, if a woman dreams of a sea, she will live her life as a prostitute. That's interesting. <laughs> but comment below what you think about it. That's one of the old, old, old interpretation, which I bought the book. So, Ar Artemidoro. So, read about him. He's an interesting guy. So my dream sequence, what I've dreamt about, is that I was in the ocean with a so soft board, thing, those things that you could ride on a beach. As, a, as I look around me, there were scattered pieces of a ship. I guess the ship got wrecked. As I closed my eyes, all of a sudden, I was near a land, a beach with random people that I have no idea who they were. We then proceeded to walk around the beach. As I walk around the beach, I saw some stairs that lead to nowhere. I, but that's not the case after because I then I decided to climb up the stairs. Where at the end of the stairs, I saw a house. And then it changed into a car where a man was calling for a woman whom I don't know who was with the group. And I don't know the faces of the group. I don't know who they are. <laughs> and she went with him and the car was very fancy look red it like it looks like a um chevrolet the, the speed car looking and i said to my head oh she must be a gold digger it was it was a strange dream for for like really strange and then my interpretation of this dream is that from my current light it is that dead, dead calm no problem with rep no problem which represent in my dream how calm the water is yet the wreckage represents my hidden problem, which is my problem at work, waiting to be announced. I don't like how things are going and an ethical ways, which I won't disclose for company's privacy. So, so that's my dream. It's kind of short, but hey, the shorter the better, right? But if you guys want me to do more and have more interpretation. There's a lot of interpretation because I I bought I bought like a lot of books for dreams because I wanted to know people's perspective and also their definition of the dreams. But it could be more than what they are saying because what they're saying is it's like a dictionary. <laughs> it's like this is what you have to do if you dream this and that and those. But with knowing dreams more like in depth in depth in depth with it you could it could have multiple implications multiple instruction multiple vision that you should be aware of one thing only leads to another thing it's like baby step it's like for me it's colors Colors signifies for me as vision and also feeling how I felt. I'm mul not just those, but multiple things I have to read over and what I think about it. So, like I said, thank you guys for listening to me and watching my videos. Actually, listening more, not watching my videos, but listening to me. And please subscribe. It will help me a lot, and um, thank you so much. I I do love, I do have wicked dreams, and I would I'm willing to share it with you guys. I have more more to upload, but I have to find ways to make it more understandable, and people will like and interest interest. And if you guys comment below, I will comment back. I do love people's perspective and hearing from them. So, thank you so much and have a great time. Bye!